So I got a question for you. When you guys are sitting in the cafeteria and your plate's in front of you, what does it take to get that food to you? Well, it takes a lot. It really does. Like, first they have to do, like actually either come from the animal or be like harvested or like actually like, grown from the ground. And then it has to go through a whole process of like cleaning and just making sure it's good for like store store use. And then it gets it gets sold out into different type of companies and then the different type of companies buy them. The good food purchase the purchasing program is a program that essentially aligns public spending with public values. Um, so our school district uh, spends millions of dollars each year on food to serve students in the Buffalo Public Schools. And if we can um, help the district align that spending, that money, with um, values, the five values of the program, we can turn a lot of things around for our region. So the five values of the Good Food Purchasing Program uh, are uh, local economies, nutrition, environmental sustainability, a valued workforce, and uh, animal welfare. So, so we're in the process of continuing to build relationships with the district um, and figuring out how we can support the food service department. I've been in the Buffalo Public Schools for like, since middle school-ish, and we don't have any education around our food. We have like no agency to like choose like how, what we eat or how it's produced and like. The food. One of the key changes that we'd really like to see is the community more involved in um, what the district is serving. Community would be students and young people, could also be parents and um, getting folks more engaged in what is served and what um, how the district is spending its money. So. Um, additionally, the program, if we are lifting up those voices of the key constituents being the students and the parents, um, we're having a stronger good food purchasing program for our district. So when they're speaking up about what they want to see in terms of their school lunches, um, and they're directly engaged in that advocacy, we're going to have a better school lunch program. In my school, I'd like to see... I'd like to see kitchens. I'd learned recently that not all schools have kitchens. Like, not not all farmers have like grow the same way. And if they all, and if there's like this big giant purchaser in the area, which is the Buffalo Public Schools, we buy a ton of food. If we put that power behind supporting the farms that do grow more ethically and do grow better for the environment, it would create a tremendous impact. We're spending our tax money on certain foods. So if we can make sure that our tax money that we're given over is being spent on foods that's boosting up our community, then that's going to make a difference. So when you hear that term good food, what do you think of? What's good food? Well, when I think about food um, or good food or healthy food, I think about kale salad. Kale salad is really good. I also when I think about good food, I feel like yeah, I think about food that's also like it's tasty but it's good for you. What do you like in food? What do you look for? I look for the taste, not for the look. And um, I also look if it's healthy or not. Like they have good food that has bad smell, bad smells but good taste. And um, they have food that looks really good, good smell but really bad taste. That's what I really hate.